Where was I?、Um, you were going to do a tribute of Mike Walker. Yeah, Mike Walker died.、Uh, Mike used to be on our show years ago when we were on testicle radio, terrestrial radio. And.、Uh, He was a guy who was a reporter for the National Enquirer, and he had this、uh, great column in the National Enquirer where it was like little paragraphs of information, quick、Sometimes、tidbits. A, an occasional blind item. Oh, yes, very much so. <laughs> and I think、uh, I got started with this so that he wouldn't write anything bad about me. Now, as Mike even said, he said, You know, you're pretty untouchable. He goes,、uh, I don't find you, you know, doing anything. You're not、weird. up to anything. You're not up to anything. Believe me, we've learned. What are they going to write about your painting? Yeah, right. <laughs> But、uh, I haven't spoken to Mike in a long time. I mean, we stopped doing the celebrity.、Uh, the game, uh, the, the game. National Enquirer game. The game was Mike would give us a true story from the pages of the National Enquirer and then three fake ones, and you had to figure out which one was true. Robin was very good at it.、And、Fred was good. Fred was, Fred was very good. Yeah. But he was probably the best known gossip reporter and writer. I think that the National Enquirer ever had. I mean, oh, absolutely. You know, he, he actually. Anyway, we always enjoyed it. Even celebrities would come in and play the game with us.、Mm -hmm. Al Franken was one of those people. Wow.、Uh, Chappelle used to play with us, and Pink came in and did it. Flava Flav. Even Michelle Williams. You know. But,、uh, you know, so we play this game, and we have a, a ton of great drops. From Mike, because <laughs> he always acted out his news stories and he even made orgasm sounds when he was doing a report on.、Uh... <laughs> Here, I'll play you some. These are, let me go. I, I put together a little page of stuff that would help you remember Mike. Yeah, here, here, here's a montage of some of the little acting and sound bites we used to use of Mike. Hello. Y'all ready to party? I just love my new big boobs. They make these tops look so hot. Fire! <laughs> hey, how about a reach around? Whoa! My hump, my hump, my lovely lady lumps. Eek! Can I tell you my favorite Matt Dillon story real briefly? <laughs> yeah, how about that? <laughs> And then, like, Mike used to, Mike was in our studio. He would be on a remote microphone somewhere.、Yeah. And sometimes we would hear Mike doing weird shit in the background while he was waiting to come on. Right. And one time we heard him playing the conga. For, for real, like, like he was waiting to get on the air and he was just in his home playing the conga.、Uh, occasionally, I,、uh, I tap a. Actually, it's not a bongo, it's a conga. Let me hear this. He likes、Matthew、to beat the、so. skins. All right, here it is, Mike playing the conga. Holy cow. Boy, you're good. What song、uh, is this? this? Wasn't, but this wasn't today. I haven't touched them today. Oh. Maybe this was last week. I think that's in a God of the Vida, baby. <laughs> yeah, he was into conga, of all things. That was、he、his was, thing. He was very unusual. Yes, Glenn. You there? Hello. Hi. Howard. Yes. Howard, you got. Howard, you got to play、uh, When He Busted Mike Walker and He Blew the Big Fart. Oh, I was getting、But. to that. Okay, classic. <laughs> all right, all right. Let me do that now. Um, so while Mike was waiting to get on the air, we think he farted. And, and at first, like Mike really got mad at me for this,、yes. but at first he tried to deny it, but eventually he did admit it was real. <laughs> <laughs> this was really a fart. Here's Mike farting. I mean, yeah, here's Mike farting into the mic. Allegedly. Allegedly. You tell me if it's real. If I'm lying, then you, you call me a liar. <laughs> I'm very proud of what's going on. Oh, wow. You know, how do I know? Oh, I think it's terrible, Mike. I'm with you. I was already laughing in the back. He was just tickled by that. But、um, it's really、uh, weird finding that fart. But Richard, you found the fart, right? Like, how did you find that? If he's around, because it's, it's some fart. It sounds like an alien birth. He's coming in, Howard, and the story of how he found it, I remember, is just awesome. Yeah. Was his ass mic'd? Because, I mean, you really, you know, you could really hear what was going on. Hi. Hi. But for me, it was like when Indiana Jones finds the Holy Grail in the movie. How did you like, even find that? Well, 
our audio computer program we use, you can see waveforms. It's, you know, like you see a flat line when it's silence and you see when there's audio activity. Yeah. activity. So I would just go through the whole file of Mike, you know, afterwards, after he was on the show, and I'd check and see what was going on before he came on the air. <laughs> Good man. And I saw this large wave like this uh you know big bounce in the like audio. an oscilloscope yeah. <laughs> yeah and i was like oh mike must have fell out of his chair or he must have dropped something mm. i went back and listened to it i was like you gotta be fucking kidding me this is the greatest thing ever <laughs> like on our show that's like the discovery of king tut it you know really what i mean was. it was i was that's so the, our shroud of turin yeah let me hear it again <laughs> Here's Mike farting. I mean, yeah, here's Mike farting into the mic. Allegedly. Allegedly. You tell me if it's real. If I'm lying, then you you call me a liar. <laughs> I'm very proud of what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, how do I know? How did I know? I like to, like, oh. you know, sometimes.